find me. And she turned, transcendentally, passing garbage bags and city hags who wouldn't ask for a drag from a burning spliff that was lit on Christmas in place of the dreams that had leaned against one another and was forged in the minds of brothers. But there was another who had the same mother, and each night she prayed with finely written words that said, bless the heart of the reckless, for some end up stressed, contemplating bullets to the chest, but rest, for God, he has been tried on your test. At first, silence. And the split burn flames of violence. Secondly, a bit of reprieve as a sailor scans the sea after a white squall has thrown his ship against a steel wall. Thirdly, God repeated loudly, do not worry for that is not the path that he is desired. And with that fire, he will ignite a missile that will one day hit still moving ducks that cluck each time he hit just like that thick yellow smoke that caused his throat to choke but the master holds true and pulls it back on the yoke for out them bones he would create brand new gifts to return to his lost brothers on Christmas, to sew up parts of the rift that cannot be healed by counting drags from that hag's split. So beat, bang, boom, because in between the city streets and the heat, there sleeps the colossal concrete beast in heat that now wails out to me from the deeps. So remember, as Sensei said, watch your feet. It is only humans to know baboons to think that you suddenly twist the handle and you can enter into the room.